Disney used to be the go-to company for family entertainment. That magic has been gone for some time. In the past, you got visually appealing animated films such as Pocahontas, The Little Mermaid, Aladdin, etc. There were also fun and entertaining movies, TV shows, and TV movies like Flubber, Shrunk Series, even Stevens, and the list goes on. Modern Disney, they replaced good storytelling with political agendas. Their animated TV shows and movies have been pushing an anti-white racism and an LGBTQ narrative that should never be pushed on anybody, including kids. On top of that, you get mediocre to very bad live-action remux of their popular animated movies, purchases of companies like Lucasfilm and Fox, which was used to ruin popular franchises from those studios like Star Wars. Besides Star Wars, their biggest downhill slope is Marvel. It was huge up until Avengers Endgame because their narratives was yet to be pushed on everybody. I would count Spider-Man No Way Home, which came out after Endgame, but Sony is a big part of that franchise, and they prevented Disney from making it what people calls woke, which, believe it or not, saved the movie and made it as big as it was. There is a reason why movies like Captain Marvel, The Love and Thunder, Doctor Strange 2, and shows like She-Hulk got a lot of criticism. It's woke. When people say woke, they're saying that they have a political agenda to push racism toward Caucasians, sexism toward males, and also pushing the LGBTQ movement onto everyone, including kids. Long story short, Disney is no longer a family-friendly company. Instead of making family-friendly content with good storytelling, they would rather appease to the cult people calls the LGBTQ community. If you want to see Disney succeed in the future, Kevin Feige, Kathleen Kennedy, and people like them must go. Someone like John Favreau, actually cares about the franchises, would be a better choice to run the company.